Good morning. It is December 2nd, 2021. It is a Thursday. Thanks a lot for coming in and checking up on me. Probably you didn't notice, <laughs> but I missed a day yesterday and that sucks. And today I'm walking around my building because the path that I'm normally going is, well, you see behind me, it's flooded. <laughs> it's that guy driving by on his bike. So the streets are flooded. Back there is not flooded, but at least the part where I'm able to step down into the street, it's all flooded. And so I say, hey, I'm gonna just walk around my building today. I've been doing every four laps. I'll do a set of push-ups and yeah, I'm here and I'm doing it. And it's good to be out here. Um, making a comment on that yesterday. Man, there's a lot of bikers right now. A couple things. Let me, let me just talk about the dates before I get into yesterday. Oh, this morning is absolutely beautiful. It is absolutely beautiful. The weather, I think the good weather is here to stay. Uh, it's finally that time of year, December. Normally about November, it starts to get nice and cool. And honestly, it has been very cool in the mornings. But today is just nice and crispy. I love this weather. Love it. Love it. It feels like my, there's my mile. It feels like my uh, bedroom at night. Just not, it's, it's about, I don't know, I want to say it's in the low 70s right now. Yeah, it's really, really nice. Um, which, which makes me a little sad because let me show you over here too. So that's that's our that's where we come in. Well, I don't know if you can see the light like, glistening upon there. Yeah, it's all flooded over there. <laughs> so anyway, oh yeah, the weather is beautiful right now. Oh, I wish it could stay like this all year long. If it could, I think Ho Chi Minh City wouldn't have 10 million people. It'd have. 30 million people here. Perfect weather. Kind of where my wife's from. Dalat, which is nice and cool year round. Okay, so yesterday, I missed my workout yesterday. Uh, so I woke up yesterday morning. The previous night before I went to sleep, I was working on this video project. One of those really big projects. Uh, not super big, 80, 80 videos long. But as I'm working on it, uh, I just get into this groove, you know? I'm enjoying it, I'm making videos, and finding little shortcuts here and there to make my workflow faster. And it comes bedtime about 9, 9 15. I actually push the bucket a little bit. I actually don't stop working on the videos until 9 30. And I don't shut my computer down either. I just leave it as it is, jump into bed, and I don't get to sleep about 10 o'clock, which for me, is pretty late, if you haven't noticed. But I get to sleep about 10 o'clock, and I wake up in the morning, same time, 4.45, and I'm just, I, I walk into my room, I usually have my water bottle to wake me up in the morning. I have my water bottle at my desk, full of water, fill it up the night before. So I take a swig of water and look at my computer and it's still on and it's still got that project that I was working on the, the night before. And so I sit down and I say, okay, well, let me wake up a little bit. Just wake up a little bit and uh, let's, uh, let's work on this a little bit. Didn't, no, a little bit didn't happen. I started working on it, working on it. And then I started looking at the clock. And sure enough, I thought I was on there for about five minutes. <laughs> It was about six o'clock already. I'm like, oh no. So I think it try to reason to myself. I say, man, I really should get out there, get my day started, like I normally do every day. I say, okay, well, I'll push it. I'll push it through this afternoon because I've got a talk. I've got to work on. I've got to work, and then yeah, I've got all this stuff I got to do. So I'll work on it. Uh, work on it. I'll go out for my walk in the afternoon before my talk and after work. Didn't happen. Didn't happen. And along with that, there's a lot of things that I should have gotten done. So my whole morning routine, my text, reading, my day's text, 
um, my during my personal video this video if I didn't get that done upload to YouTube like a lot a lot of stuff I should have gotten done and I didn't get it done I didn't get it done so yeah so it, it, it's a good lesson I had to tell myself if I'm ever working on a project I need to shut my computer down at night before I go to sleep because of that temptation especially if it's a fun project to work on it more in the morning so what's a life lesson I can take away from there temptations are there and one way to avoid falling into that trap of temptation is to make the temptation invisible I preach it so much and even I'm still a, a victim to it make it invisible and it's so funny that that's a temptation to work but that kind of work doesn't feel like work to me I kind of enjoy it it's it's problem solving it's figuring out best optimized ways to create content yeah I really enjoy that kind of work and so anyway that's uh yeah that's a lesson I took away from yesterday that yeah you gotta make things invisible how about you? How's your day going? Think going good? Any life lessons you've taken away from the past days that you'd like to share with me? Please leave it in the comments. I will respond to your comments. I really appreciate everything you do and everything you are able to uh, share with me as I'm trying to output some sharing myself. So I'm kind of sad a little bit because it was on I feel like I just want to go back to my my normal spot over here. <laughs> just feel like it's it's part of the routine. So I'm just going to walk down, walk down the steps to uh, my little area that I put my phone in the morning. <laughs> and, uh, interesting, interesting. Why do I like putting it here? I think I can talk a little bit more. Hmm. Not worried about holding the camera interesting I feel like this video isn't complete if I haven't stretched out a little bit more over here to talk to the camera while it's propped up against this metal iron bar so it's, it's a guardrail really it's just a just a railing but I prop up the phone right here I always put it right there and uh, I don't know I just felt like I I wanted to put it put it up right there today interesting Anyway, I was kind of sad I was saying because yesterday was December 1st and I'm all about kicking off the kicking off the, the month really, really strong. And uh, dang it, <laughs> dang it, I miss, I missed the day. And there's a lot of things that come at the end of the month for me. Uh, making my new habit wheels, taking pictures of my old habit wheels and trying to make this nice animation that I can keep for a long, long time. So I didn't get that done yet, but I will get that done today. And so I have to plan out my month um nothing huge I, i'm we're still waiting on what's going to happen with covid and and schools here but guaranteed it's going to be at least till the end of semester one that they're going to be studying online um but yesterday we had 1600 cases that's crazy 1600 cases cases and that's not actively testing anymore that's insane so I think I think the real COVID cases are up in the I don't know six thousand seven thousands seven thousands daily. People are out there getting COVID. Yes, yes, uh, we are vaccinated, you know. But still, yeah, I don't know. The possibility of catching it seems like it's getting easier and easier. Anyway, um, I'm trying not to have any holes in my schedule. I was proud to say that I only missed three days before of my walks. And then December, November, I missed one more day. And then on my fourth day. And then yesterday is my fifth day. And that was, that was interesting because the fourth day and fifth day came really close to each other. So I gotta be careful about that. I gotta be careful of why I'm letting smaller things like that you know, interfere into this good stuff because this, I promise you, is uh, it's a it's a domino. It's a domino effect, 
and it it just rolls and rolls and rolls if I don't do this first part a lot of my morning doesn't happen so that's why I need to do this first part so it gets the ball rolling I've got my schedule I've got my routine down so figure out what's your routine hmm anyway love you guys thank you guys very much for watching and I, I noticed that some people are leaving more comments and I appreciate that and I will get back to you love you guys thank you and uh, we'll see you guys tomorrow all right take care aloha